Well, hey there, everybody. Rhonda Boyle here. I'm so glad you're joining me for this series on growing and develop your strengths finder talent. Today, we're talking about the talent theme of woo. Woo is the only talent that is an acronym. It stands for winning others over, and that's what people high in woo do. Now, just so you know, only about 12%, just a little over 12% of people who have taken the assessment over 17 or nearly 17 million at the time of this recording have woo in their top five. So it's not very common. And you know who these people are. Uh, number one, here I'm going to go over now the seven ways to grow and develop your woo. Number one, meet and greet the people every day. Uh, you are a peopler and you get energy from people. You need to be around people and especially new people each and every day. So make sure you're in a role in your business or in your life or at work that gives you the freedom to be out and about among the people. Tip number two, develop a networking strategy. Create a strategy so that you know who people, who all of these people are that you collect, where they fit into growing your business or in your personal uh, relationships. Join local meetup groups or other groups, socializing, networking groups. Volunteer for organizations or work on committees. Get active in your local chamber of commerce and then discern how each of these groups of people are gonna help you and where exactly they fit. So tip number three, invite others to play. As you head out and about in the networking scene, make sure that you pick up the phone or you send text messages and you invite other people with you. You enjoy being with people and mostly you like, you believe and feel that the more the merrier. And so because of your charismatic personality, it pulls others along and into the party, so to speak. So make sure you never eat a alone and that you always have a friendly face that you can take with you uh, along the way because you're helping them too. Tip number four, cross network. Across your various networks, you will find people who need to know one another. So make it a point to introduce them in person if possible. So uh, you really are a conduit for connections. And so arranging for those people to connect uh, will be great. So be generous and intentional about how you connect people to all the other people you know. Tip number five, promote others. People who know you and like you are counting on you to share their good news and to take their information and carry it into the marketplace with you because you are in the know about a lot of the things that are happening in your community. They turn to you to share. So sharing what you care about and support will allow you to carry their messages out and about so that they can be connected. Tip number six, become a champion for causes. Uh, because you are a natural promoter, you can also naturally promote the causes uh, and things that you love. So be a campaigner for your favorite things. Maybe it is a, uh, maybe you're passionate about puppies and other animals. So lend your energy and your network and your connections uh, to the cause. You can be, in a sense, a crusader for whatever cause uh, that you want to. You can be promoting fundraising, you can volunteer for their telethons and other types of campaign, development campaigns, capital campaigns and that type of thing. So you can be a really, that's how your gifts and talents can help other people. Uh, tip number seven, understand your energy. People high in woo have a powerful energy that they do not feel or know that they're putting off. They don't recognize the energy that comes off of them physically. Uh, other people, you may make their nerve endings fairly sizzle with the energy that you put off that you're not even aware of. So pay attention to the reactions of the people around you and learn how to temper your energy depending upon the circumstances. That'll help you grow and develop your woo talent so that you can be more effective when you use it. 
There you go. Those are seven ways to grow and develop your woo talent theme. Real quickly again, number one, meet and greet the people every day. Number two, develop a networking strategy. Number three, invite others to play. Number four, cross network. Number five, promote others. Number six, become a champion for causes. Number seven, understand your energy. There you go. Seven ways for you to grow and develop your woo talent into strength. Thanks for joining me. This is Rhonda Boyle and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.